Welcome to a new video. Both latest gloves and face masks are products mostly used by people dedicated to work in medical field. However, for its elaboration, different processes must be followed with strict quality standards. This is why, today, I will tell you how latest gloves and face masks are made. Let's begin. For latest gloves, you need molds with a standard hand size. These are usually made of ceramic or aluminum. A conveyor belt is responsible for immersing these molds in a solution to remove any contaminants they may have. After this, they pass through rotating brushes, which are responsible for cleaning hard-to-reach areas. Once free of impurities, the molds are bathed in hot water, and after drying, they are immersed in a tub with latex. When they have been covered with a layer of latex, each mold passes through an oven, where thanks to the heat, the material adheres completely to the shape of the hand, obtaining greater elasticity and resistance. After this, they go to a brush mechanism, which is responsible for winding one of its ends. All this so that the gloves can be manipulated more easily when they are removed from the ceramic molds, which it is generally accomplished using pressurized air. Once these steps are complete, each glove goes to the test area, where they are stretched and inflated to verify that they have no holes. Also, some of them are chosen at random to be filled with water, checking that they do not have any leaks. After this, they are packaged and ready to be sold. Now I will tell you about the elaboration of mouth covers. For the procedure, three types of fabric are used, which are automatically unfolded by a machine, which is also in charge of adding a foil to the sides. After going through a sealing process, the already attached fabric is subjected to the body forming process, where a kind of mold gives it the desired shape. Finally, the fabric is simply cut into small pieces and cords are added to the size, thus forming mouth mass that can be adjusted correctly to the face. Finally, it should be noted that both latex gloves and face masks have a reduced lifetime, so it is not recommended to reuse this type of product. If you want to know a little more about the manufacturing process of latex gloves and face masks, I invite you to visit the channel. In the same way, I give you a cordial invitation to our website, www.raviusnews.com. There, you will find the latest news of your favorite brands. The link, I will also left it in the description. Currently, due to the pandemic that is happening in the middle of 2020, these products have been in great demand. Even some of them have begun to scarce. For this reason, it is advisable to use gloves and masks in a responsible way. In this way, the medical personnel will be able to access them without any problem. Now that you know the manufacturing process for latex gloves and face masks, I would like to know your opinion. What part of the elaboration of these products do you find more interesting?